out with these gummy bears. What's that? There's a rough texture to them that is usually indicative of there's been some sort of air, exposure to air. You know how gummies get when oh, they've been yeah. in the air too long? Yeah. I thought I just broke the seal, but every single one I've eaten so far is like a crusty outside. That seems not good. Should I stop eating them? Probably. Get a different bag, maybe? I have another one. I have a second. I was planning on eating two bags. Okay. I, uh, coincidentally, I also have my barf bag. I did not even plan that. Isn't that funny? <laughs> I'm going to give these one more chance. I only have three gummies left, so I've eaten most of the pack. Something must have gone wrong with these. Well, i got to go get a fork. I'll get you another gummy. They have sort of a scaly finish. <clears throat> it's like fish scales on the outside of these gummies. I ate most of the bag. Uh-oh. Chat isn't working. Let me revive you. Maybe. Oh, I know what we have to do. Wake. Wake this little critter up. Wake up, critter. Rise and shine, little critter. Oh, no, it needs... It needs a password. Password protected. Oh, no. Can't get in the chat. I inspected the bag for tampering. It seems fine. You know this password. Oh... Uh. It's the same as the door. Happy 4th of July. Everyone's excited about the 4th of July. Everybody's excited about the sphere in Las Vegas. The what? Have you seen the sphere in Vegas? The sphere? Yes, there's a sphere that landed in Vegas and projecting... Look it up. What? Projecting images on the outside of it. And they're stunning. It's alien-like, Swordfish0830 says. They're like a giant eyeball. It's very awesome. Everyone loves the sphere. I couldn't stop watching footage of the sphere this morning. Whoa. Are you seeing it? It's a giant building. There you go. Red Sky put something in there. RF switch doesn't like fireworks. Did you ever like them, RF, or was it over the... I'm actually As already you... looking at that same article, RF. Huh. Which one? Oh, Either that one. same one. Or not RF, uh, right there. You got to see it in motion, though. Oh, when it went to a giant moon, it was like a photorealistic moon. It looked so rad. So the... wait, is it a building or is it just there to distract people? I guess it's a concert venue, I believe, or something. Whoa. It's like an entertainment venue. So RF always hated fireworks. Even when they were just a little tiny rascal. It seats 18,000 people, Red Sky is telling us. Wow. That's yep. cool. How did I never hear about this being built in television? They kept it. Seen? I know. I guess they kept it quiet. They weren't, you, none of, no one was hearing about this thing. And then suddenly they did this test thing on 4th of July and everyone's going nuts for it. Oh, so it literally happened yesterday. That's when they lit it up and Holy did like shit. a long dem visual demonstration of its all its capabilities. It makes me nervous about the maintenance, though. Anytime I see something like this, I think, look. I, my first thought was how many car accidents is this thing going to cause? That's the thing. There are people that are like pulled over on some bridge or something. They just like parked their car and got out of the car and they're recording because of a giant moon that looked like it just landed in Vegas. I mean, the angle was so cool. And because it was photorealistic, it looked really good. Yeah. So if someone's just driving around, they don't know what's going on. They're going to start freaking out when they see this giant eyeball. Does it sometimes do an eyeball? It was a few times. They did not just a human eye, but then they did like a weird, trippy monster eye and like all these different eyes. It just looks so cool. Halloween will be great. For they had year. a giant, they made it as a giant punk jack-o'-lantern oh, wow. during the demonstration. So it's just demonstrating all the things. It demonstrated like a bunch Christmas, of stuff. Christmas, you could do like a giant ornament. Oh. oh, one of the things they did was this weird mirror-like yeah ornament that was just like shimmering with like weird mirror reflect like chrome reflections it looked so weird how many birds are gonna hit this thing yeah birds and the maintenance so like one of the you know giant panels gonna go out or something and there's gonna be like only two people on earth that can fix it and they're gonna be busy at a barbecue <laughs> yeah 
Remember laser light shows at the planetarium? Oh yeah, I've been to a few of those. Sort of like watching the sphere. That's true, Swordfish. That's a good comparison. The laser light shows are fun. How dare an Aronofsky plans to immerse audiences in the first production for MSG Sphere? What is that? What's so wait, does it have projections on the inside and the outside? That I didn't know. I thought I assumed it was only the outside, but I don't know. How expensive is this building? It was like 2.3 billion. Holy shit. Billion. So what's Darren Aronofsky doing here? He's going to do something with the sphere? We wanted to convey as broad a taste of the cornucopia of life, natural beauty, and human achievement as we could. Postcard from Earth. Okay. A billion. It opens this fall at the sphere. This is going to be the place to be. Now hotels are going to be selling sphere view rooms, I bet. Oh, wow, yeah. You pay a little extra for a clear view of the sphere. The Vegas sphere. This thing's going to be so huge, I predict. I see the sphere as a great opportunity to pluck people from the bling and thrum of the Vegas Strip in all its human constructed madness <sighs> and immerse them in as and immerse them as fully as possible in the wonder, awe, and beauty of the natural world. <laughs> okay. It's gonna plunge them far deeper into the <laughs> It's a sci-fi journey deep into our future as our descendants reflect on our shared home. It uses a new camera system called Big Sky. Oh man, if only Avatar 2 could have pre could have premiered on this thing, it would have been huge. They're making a larger sphere in Dubai called Moon. That's exactly what I thought of. When I saw the sphere, I thought of Dubai and I said, I yeah. bet they're looking at this thing and just going, you know what? This is not impressive. Watch the hold my beer kind of deal. Because yeah. they already have the whole buildings that are projected on pretty much. Hold my beer. <laughs> the single lens camera has a 316 megapixel, three inch by three inch HDR image sensor that Sphere Studios says can capture. 18k by 18k images up to 120 frames per second i'm obviously i'm actually not surprised I, I would think it would be even higher specs than that i mean that image looked good yeah and from every angle that well, i saw i suppose at that scale like <clears throat> there there does become a point where any further detail would just be pointless because like you'd have to be you'd have to be far enough away from it to see the whole image but if you're that far away that detail would be lost that's the interesting about it. It's like when they showed the human eye and then also when they showed the moon, it was like it had such a crisp resolution that I was like, gosh, it was pretty impressive. Dubai called moon. We got to look up this moon they're building. Can you hit all four enter on there? The... Yes. Are they already building that line? That line city in Dubai or whatever? No, I think that got shut down. Oh. That was just theoretical. Oh no, did it get shut down? I mean, it would be very bad. I watched a video about it and how it would be like... It, like, line, line cities have been theorized for centuries and they're not a good idea. Dang it. Did we get it? We're doing all right, RF. Isla has a little bit of a headache, so everybody yeah. send her good vibes. Hopefully she's feeling okay. Headaches. No, I'm sorry, I'm like eating off camera. I just, I wasn't feeling well. I was not. She had a little, <clears throat> bit, little bit of a headache. I've been getting some headaches. Don, did you see the news of San Diego fireworks show? Apparently all the fireworks went off at once. Oh my gosh, I have not seen that yet. I have not seen all the fireworks in San Diego going off at once. That must be something. This is the Vegas one. Is that the moon? Yeah. The, when no, this... this is the Vegas one. This is the Dubai one. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> oh my god. Well, like, the Dubai one has the full sphere. This, yeah, the, the Dubai one is, is actually raised up off the earth. percent of a sphere. This one is kind of sunken down a little bit. Like it had an impact. Yeah. This thing is crazy. It would have been great if they could have like housed it under some giant warehouse or something so you wouldn't have seen it was a sphere until they 
Yeah. And then just like drop the curtains and it's lit up for Fourth of July. Yeah, the it, people had like you know just whatever like social media videos of the moon from different parts of the city and it looked so rad. So my question with this though is like, is the Dubai one just a projection or is it a building that you also go inside? Um, I don't know. That's Let's a good you question. Let's experience space travel from Earth. <laughs> Real life blitz ball coming down the pipes. How tall is 735 feet? How tall is a skyscraper? I don't know. 735 feet sounds tall. I think that's pretty tall. Because how tall is. Oh, okay, so it would have. Lunar surface lunar colony? <laughs> what? It's got a colony on it. Space shuttle, shuttle station, mechanical club floor. Hotel Suites, 2000. Hotel Station, Hotel Suites, 2000 more. Living Green Wall down here. Upper Disc Plaza. Good Lord. Dubai is crazy, man. <laughs> Dubai is crazy. In uh, e yeah, it is. That's fun. Everyone wants to see the sphere, so I guess it's LED panels, so it's LED uh, lights all over it. Is that what it is? I mean, it would have to be, right? Yeah, I think so. <coughs> Although, tweet about this? I'm not sure about, like, the top of that new stadium in here, SoFi, that has some kind of, they have, like, clear panels on the roof. It's like a clear dome, not a dome, right. but they have clear roofs, but somehow they light up and they can, like, animate and do all kinds. Of, I don't think the resolution is quite as impressive or the colors or anything as that, but they do light up. Magical bark in the house. A buenos dias. Buenos dias, magical bark. We're talking sphere. The whole world's going nuts for this sphere. They're building another one in London. We're halted after residents protested the light pollution. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. I thought light pollution was debunked. Is that real? What? Light you pollution? You just look at it. it I thought it... that wasn't a real thing. What? Light pollution. It's definitively real. It was never in dispute. Well, I guess. You just look outside. Well, I guess. I thought our eyes were constantly adapting to more and more light. Well, yeah, maybe, but... <sighs> Any more commemorative movie popcorn buckets? What did I buy when I went to Indiana Jones? I certainly stuffed myself. I didn't get anything commemorative. They didn't have any indie stuff. Can you believe that? What kind of world are we living in when they don't have indie stuff at the concession stand? They couldn't have put that together? Don. Red's RF switch got similar. I gotta get on camera for this. I saw, guess what I did last night on the 4th of July? What? I loved it, Red Sky. I uh, went and saw Indiana Jones. Ooh, and did you love it? I actually did. Good. <laughs> I actually really loved it. It was a great movie. I um, was pretty surprised that I liked it. It was really good. And it was funny because we were feeling like a little bit of FOMO because it was 4th of July. We were like, I feel like there should be a party or something, but there was like kind of nothing going on. And so we were like, let's just go to the movies. And then like... Uh, Ash and uh, Mort showed up. Like, also. I just, I'm just i buying tickets and I just hear Isla? <laughs> That's There's funny. Ash, at the Ash same the theater at the same... Have. How funny. And we were like one of like ten people in the whole theater. A movie popcorn bucket? It'd be cool to be some kind of like, tra like, like I don't know, chest or something. Some like... Uh, CDJ Gamer got the new passion fruit Baja Mountain Dew and says it's pretty good. Where did you get this thing? Is it available? Passion fruit? 
Turn off your damn notification. I just turned it off. And there's a small wave race nod in the Mario movie that Magical Bark is claiming. Is this true? Tell me what it is. What is the wave race, wave race nod, Magical Bark? What is the wave race nod? A chest full of popcorn. Yeah, that would be sick. Huh? Is like Ashley doing? Like She's a fine. Dirty cobweb covered chest, and then you creak it open. You got a bunch of buttered popcorn in there. <laughs> It could be like the Ark. They could have done an Ark of the... Whatever, the Ark of the Coven or whatever it's called. Hell yeah. Oops, it helps if I plug this audio into the computer that we... Filled with popcorn. They mentioned one of the racers in the news report just on the scroller thing at the bottom. No way! I'm gonna look for this. That is cool. That is awesome. Has Bloodworth seen the sphere yet? Bloodworth! I got it in cans too. Will you get a TMNT bucket? Oh, CJ, I'd love to. I gotta be honest. I'm too tall. I'm not 100% feeling the art style yet. I'm still not feeling it. I'm trying to. In which? TMNT. The movie? Yeah, the new one. I think it looks kind of cute. The bucket would probably look sharp. You have your face melted and get struck by chain lightning when you open up your Ark of the Covenant popcorn bucket. <laughs> Unless your eyes are shut. Yeah, just melt. Yeah, yeah, shut your eyes. Yeah. It melts into your popcorn and you just you like dissolve into your popcorn bucket and then your neighbor just sort of sees the opportunity and starts scarfing. Mr. Sunday Movies was doing, <clears throat> they were talking about all the Indiana Jones movies and they, it's really funny because they always just describe that as like that time he saw God in a box oh. <laughs> <laughs> or found God in a box or whatever. Oh, so when the drain is flooding. I'm gonna look for that. Yeah, there's like a news ticker at the bottom, and they mention one of the wave racers. That is a, that good, is a good sign. Easter egg. That is huge. I'm telling you, I've said it a couple of times. I don't know if people are gonna start listening to me. I want to say it again here. I have a very good feeling. Wave race, the next one, could be a launch game for the new, powerful next gen Nintendo console, which I believe will be powerful. Yeah. And I believe this will be a triple-A game and it might be a launch title. Why else would they be putting wave race nods like Fully that? Fully simulated waves. Oh, the water. They'll, they'll place an in-game sphere in the middle of the ocean that bobs up and down and makes the waves. Oh. And difficulty ocean settings sphere. increase the, the ferocity of the sphere. Oh. Could with Nintendo do that? Blood. <laughs> Wave race instead. That exists, right? What is that game called? Story. Synth Rider or whatever? Line Rider? Next gen wave physics. Okay, I'm feeling better now. A little bit. Oh, you need a little bit of food, man. A little bit better. Yeah, I need some ibuprofen and some food. Sorry we're starting late today, Chatty Poop Babies. We had a shoot that today was the only time we could organ big, organize everybody big, big to get it. Big recording sesh. You know, big old recording. Sweetie baby sweetness? Sweetie baby sweetness cheeks is in chat? Wishing everyone well, look at that. Sweetie baby sweetness cheeks. How you doing, Charles? <clears throat> I've taken to calling Sophia Charles the way Magneto calls Charles call Xavier Charles. <laughs> Sweetie Baby Sweetie Cheeks is her full legal sweetie name. Sweetie Baby Sweetie Cheeks Charles. I do call her Cheeks sometimes. She probably loves that I'm divulging all of this that. information. Our personal cutie baby names for each other. Little, little pet names. <laughs> there it is, the dots. We've been waiting for those dots. Yeah, if you missed it, uh, Sophia was actually just here on camera with all of us. Well, what? with Gabby and, and, and Huber and I, and we did a full playthrough of Amnesia the Bunker. Oh my gosh. Which is an okay game. Amnesia. It works as a cute little guide end, you know, side story. Now we're jumping into Dave the Diver, baby. I've heard that this game is amazing. 
Settle down, Tarantino. So far, so good, I guess. Yeah, Marvel yeah, a lot so of far. feet, huh? Uh-oh. Where's that crab gonna go? Oh, uh... Oh, thank goodness. Pretty sure that bit him on the D, huh? Yeah. Looked like it. Well, who's this fella? Ooh, that iced tea looked good. This looks, this whole situation looks nice, relaxing. Let's go on vacation. Yeah, we gotta get to a beach. Yeah. Can the sphere simulate a beach for us? <laughs> Just sit outside of it in the mm. parking lot. Like a blazing yeah. hot parking lot outside the sphere. <laughs> uh, yeah, 300 degrees like a outside. Beach chair. Stay in the car. <laughs> Die. Good night, Buenos Noches. Magical Gently down park, the street. dude. Jumping in just like we are. Yeah, I've heard that this game is really, really good. It has like an incredible, incredibly high rating. This would have been an amazing uh, Fantasy League pickup, but nobody knew about it. Nice little pickup. Drinking some root! Yeah, Sophia, I've started it on stream. Is that okay? Sophia and I were talking about playing this. Oh, no! But she's here, so it's okay. Oh, good. Oh, it was an early access, so we couldn't have. Okay. I could go for a nice cold root. I think Jonesy did. RF Switch. Jonesy put SMRPG on there. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I don't really know what the gameplay of this game is. Also, bold move to have the... Full credits? Just make up for it by playing Jedi Survivor. Okay, sweetie. She really wants me to play Jedi Survivor. Really? Oh. Cobra, dude! Oh, Dave, you got there quick mm. here quickly. Push it off. Oh, <laughs> 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 Graphics are so nice. Yeah, they look nice. Sushi bar by the blue hole. Has any of has Huber or anybody streamed this yet? Oh, this looks nice. Huber is the. Contingencies. You know, you're not supposed to fight a shark with your knife, they tell you. You're supposed to bonk it with the butt. Yeah, of or just knife, push right? it push it away. You hit it in the eye if it's getting really aggressive, but at first you can just push it away. Oh. I thought you were supposed to bonk him on the nose. Yeah, I was gonna play this. I don't think there's any structures, hopefully. The graphical style, I mean, yeah, who knows? Maybe I'll get propped by structures, but the graphical style is probably fine. Uzi does a spinning roundhouse kick to get rid of any sharks that are menacing them underwood. Oh, okay, that's a good technique, probably. Oh. <laughs> Aim with A, fire with right trigger. Flying elbow? You do a flying elbow on a... Oh, okay, that's how you Okay, so it has a rangé. Right away, we're under here and they're telling us to spear these fish. Look at that. Oh, nope. this is tough. These fish are tiny. Oh, brutal I kill. I didn't know this game was going to have blood in it like that. Ooh, let's get this one. Finding Dory. Boom. See you in hell, fish. See you in hell, Dory. Ellen DeGeneres. A blue tang. Is that a real fish? Yeah, look at this. This is kind of fun. Look at this. These, we're killing fish. 
RF switch says the shark can feel the vibrations. It might, it's true, right? They can feel yeah. vibrations, so. Yeah. Very they sensitive. They say, you know what? Don't mess with this one. That's a real fish, RF says. Oh, aura? Does do auras not send out vibrations? I, ha I used to have a lot of super Hawaiian shirts in my wardrobe. Can you believe that? A whole bunch of these shirts. Swordfish. 0830. And I slowly, I got rid of them all. I started taking life very seriously. <laughs> yeah, sure. You have to pay them. <laughs> Look at this guy's happy, huh? Yeah, Dave's loving it. Dave's in a good vibes. I'm confused about the blue hole. Do they just mean this water? Or a specific dive spot or is called there like, the blue yeah, hole? Yeah, is there like a deeper blue hole? Because right now this is just a body of water. Yeah, there must be a specific... There we go. Do I have any Hawaiian shirts in my wardrobe? No, but my quilt that is on Sophia in my bed, uh, my sister made from my dad's shirts. And many of those were literally from Hawaii. <laughs> Oh, so Casey says, uh, Casey87 says, Blue Hole is English for just body of water. That's interesting, because there are, oh. I think there are a bunch of specific, like, blue holes in the world that they call Blue Hole, where it's like a dive spot. Oh, okay. But, but Casey Is this a British saying, game? Maybe it is. Mm. I'm more of a diver than a fish. Mm. It's a Korean game. Ambon vouches for this game. How empty a life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty of Mother Nature can own. I like this guy. That blue hole is freaking out. Look at this blue hole going bonkers out there. Whoa! This is not good. You're not used to being taken seriously? Is Casey ribbing me about the blue hole? Casey, stop ribbing Don's ribbing blue hole. Ribbing me about blue holes. Oh, this is a funny way to make it that we have to fix it up. This is cool. So we're spear fishers. So we get good equip good ingredients during the day and then we do sushi restaurant stuff at night. Swordfish kids has to bounce, say bye. Oh bye, sweetie. Why is our internet fucked up? What's going on? Internet's Try down. restarting the router and the modem, call. sweetheart. The incident. Everything except Twitch is working? Huh. 
Lagoon tig uh, trigger fish. Trigger fish. These are real. I think they're all real. Oh. Probably things will get crazy though. Yeah, there's gonna be some big fish. Here we go. This is what we wanted to see. We want to descend to the depths. Oh, oh armored fish, armored jellyfish. Boom! Oh, can't it's get that. It's got a that. steel, steel. Uh, oh shit! And it stings. Those are nasty buggers. So you just don't mess with those. A, a oh, seahorse? drew blood. Oh. Drew blood again. The underwater is a. Uh, can't kill the very... seahorses. Ah! You might be able to mine that jewel. There you go. Got that trigger fish. Oh, that was a wrasse. That's a big bugger! Uh oh. A yellow back fusilier. <sighs> Blood says these fish are real, but he doesn't recall anyone actually. They're not like an edible fish, they're just fish. I mean, anything's edible. Whether or not you live is the question. Oh, look at that big sushi. red fella. We're collecting these for There's sushi. There's a treasure chest, John. Oh, Done. there we go. There's some popcorn in there. Oh, shit. Give me that red, red fella. Oh, shit. Best fish for sushi go. Ah. RF Switch is asking a good question. I gotta track down this kind of fish I used to eat that was delicious. I thought it was white tuna. Do they make white tuna? And is it be the belly or something? Do they have white tuna? God, I'm horrible at this. What's is going that a on? real fish, white tuna? Yeah, albacore tuna, white albacore tuna. Oh, Shiza Minnelli, dude. Albacore tuna is white. Do you eat albacore tuna? Can't hit tuna? this guy, dude. I oh, think I've had the albacore here. though, and it's not that yummy. This was some kind of specialty. Albacore's great. What are you talking about? It is. Yeah, it's like good sushi. Is it the belly? Is it the Ahi belly of the is... albacore? Is that what? Does that ring a bell? Ahi tuna is good. What the heck is that? Underwater scooter? I want to use that. Oh. Oh, we need to surface. We're running out of air. We have a tank. We have a scooter now. That thing's awesome. I've always used one to use one of those. How fresh and where it's from. Yeah, so what is it? Sushi is fresh on uh, Fridays or what? Did we get seven? Caught seven, okay. Nice. Nice fishing. I wasn't counting. Orbicular batfish. We only got five. Yeah, salmon and tuna are ab my absolute favorite. Salmon for sure. Salmon is just I could eat piles and piles of salmon sashimi. It's like, like the penguin. I like tuna and albacore and ahi tuna. Light flavors. I don't like fish, really. Bloodworth likes tuna, snapper, and unagi. Unagi. Holy smokes. Those are some exotic tastes. I saw a place near me is uh, serving sushi tacos now. I thought that was unusual. Huh. Check your fish crops, sauces, and other materials. It's so weird, T-Beaks, how sometimes the fish smell, obviously most of the time, is not that, something about it is not that great, but uh, you know, even if it's good for, but every once in a while you walk into a place that's like a fresh fish, I'm talking about like a, uh, where they hack it up and sell it, you know, in a store. Just smells so good every once in a while when it's very fresh and clean. I don't know what it is. Oh, 
Oh. Sea bream. Jesse likes cod, haddock, and pollock. That's a good advice, Embon. If you don't live near a coast and you think you hate seafood, give it another shot next time you're near a coast. Yeah. Fresh fish. Fresh fish. Someone else, Mona. Yeah, the freezing of the fish is not great, I guess, huh? Screaming Argonaut likes like shellfish. Oh, I see. That's our menu there. You, you only get one go at it. You can't like wow. tip little extras out. It has to be absolutely perfect. A good or higher grade will pay more. God. The eel for me has always been weird because I Fish. like the, f the flavor isn't bad, but there's something crunchy in it. What is that, a spine or something you're eating? What's What's that little bit of crunchiness that eel has? Skin? Is that what it is? The skin is crunchy? I thought it was the spine or something. So when they serve you a eel sushi, they're not serving it with the bones? I thought they left the bones in the eel when they served it to you. I didn't read that. Oh no. Here we go. We're open for business. Yeah, every time I got eel sushi, there was always a crunch to it. I assumed it was the bones. Enhancing. Ah. Oh, that was nice. Yush. Saltwater eels have firmer, thicker skins than freshwater. Serve them. Oh no, this. Boom! Nice. Nice pour. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, and you have to take the right thing to them? It's small. Getting overcooked yeah. flashbacks, dude. I'm so slow. Nice. Eat, drink, love, and it's a hat. Good pour. Like it. 
Oh no, I've, I've used up my stamina. My stamina. What the hell is this? You'll be able to produce food if you run out of wasabi. Uh -oh. Grind and fill the wasabi before it runs out. This is unexpected. Grind wasabi? I didn't know that's how you made wasabi. What are you grinding it out of? A pepper? I don't know. Was that a wasabi pepper we were grinding? We did perfectly. It's a root. I had no idea that. Wasabi's a root? Wasabi's a root that you grind. Yo, this game is pretty sick. This game is amazing. <laughs> this game is pretty sick, dude. Look at these vibes, dude. Yeah. Now to relax. Try a little harder, all right. It's a horseradish. Huh. That's crazy. Is Outside that, of Japan, it's made from horseradish. Isn't it actually wasabi? You know, I think I've tasted that. You can taste the yeah, difference, you can can't you? Yeah. Imitation wasabi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Banko Sushi. Look at that cat. Oh, there's a cat in it. Oh, what's happening now? Uh oh. Uh oh, watch out, guys! Oil spill. Oh, oh no! Uh. Oh shit! Uh oh! Watch Trouble out, man! Kraken! Trouble in the deep! Oh, we got a Kraken! We got a Kraken in our midst. Oh shit. That Kraken is Kraken. Boats. They're still allowed to call it wasabi? Yeah, they should call it imitation wasabi or something, shouldn't they? Is there anything else like that? Ali's calling. That is a fake thing. I studied biology at the graduate school. Anomalies. Oceanic anomalies. Wasabi flavored paste. Oh, so that's Agar how they get away with it. and red starfish. Remember those, Those Don. are beautiful. They Spot look yummy. Those. You're my spotter. All right. Unless you want I'm to your eyes. I'm your eyes underwater. Do you want to play it all? No, it's okay. Mm. I'm your eyes underwater, but I don't like opening my eyes underwater. You open your mm. eyes underwater? No. I don't try, I try not to go underwater. Especially in the ocean, right? That's yeah. not fun. Oh no. Opening your eyes in the water. My dad oh. insists on opening <laughs> his eyes when he, in the ocean. I think it's a very Ooh. odd thing. You could ask more. Yeah, I prefer land. Definitively. I definitively prefer land. You're a land lover. Yeah, I'm a land lover for sure. I'll take to the skies, but I, I, I don't. I don't you ever try sky, have you sky dove? Have you ever sky dove? No, before? no. Would you do a squirrel suit? Do I open my eyes under land? No. <laughs> would you I mean in a, caves. In a cave, you, would, yeah, in you caves wouldn't open your eyes? Yeah. What about a squirrel suit though? Would you do the squirrel suit along the mountainside? That seems much more dangerous. The sky. More dangerous than skydiving. Yeah. Holy crap, look at all these phones. I don't like when they bring a phone into a game like this. It's too close to reality. What you're trying to escape being out here in this exotic location. Ooh. Let's dive, baby. This is two what we're here for. and two starfish. <laughs> Base jumping does look crazy. Whatever happened to that game for that movie Fall or whatever about those girls stuck on that? Oh, uh, that's tower? out. Did it's that come it's out? It's streaming. It yeah. I don't know. It didn't work yet. Does she want any kind of star? No, red starfish. Okay. And uh, those red. Hey, wait. There's other a, there's things. something over here. We gotta check those this red out. bushes. Ooh, crockpot. Nice. Get fished. Oh lord, there's a thing down there. Oh, and there's an eel. Oh, that seems aggressive. Oh. Do I have the juice to fight you? What is this creature? Everything underwater is hunting us. Uh-oh, oh. he broke the line and he's coming back for more. Hit him again. Hit him again. Oh, he's this creature's kill ferocious. My ass. Leave us alone. We're trying to get sushi oh, fish. Oh, Shiza Manelli, dude. Things are fucked. And now you're running out of air. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're going to die down Maybe here. Maybe there's something in the pot that can save us. 
Fuck off, please. Takes that long to open the box. Oh, there's Fuck an eel. Fuck off, please. Speaking of the devil. What happened? He gave up. We were actually dead. We got salt. Wood. <laughs> Found some wood. We died. We died. Ever, no one's done the Quigon uh, quote yet. Umbra, go ahead. Use the escape pod? There it is. There it is. Mm. Nice. If not, violent streak. Oh, so that was a uh, a gun. <laughs> that was a scripted attack. Duff. Duff McKagan. These are all video calls? What's you know they game? made a Cobra game, I think, back in the late 80s from the Cobra movie? It's like a side-scrolling shooter. The G.I. Joe thing? The Cobra, uh, that was like weird, uh, what was it, Stallone? Or Sylvester Stallone, I think. Oh. Crazy what they would make games out of it. Mm. Okay. Oh. Draw Stella. <laughs> why did they it's like an anime? A, why did they give us like a logo? I, 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 I think this game has like a lot of pizzazz to it. Jesse, gift to thank you. One rope and one scrap iron. Weapon Smith Duff. All right, I can't screw this up. This is a big. Here we go. Seek and destroy. The music is nice. Seek and What's destroy. That? Oh, that's a mission item. Can I just pick this up? Oh, there's a the enemy, enemy starfish. Yeah, oh, we... that red bush might have been down there. Oh, really? I don't know if it was red or purple. Whoa. Gun him down. Pop. Boom. Thing kill. Oh, there's a little worm fish. A comer? Is that real blood? Comer? We take all comers. We take all comers here. The deal was by the. Hey, uh. Shice. That pink one is the sea goldie we need. Okay, so that was the sea goldie. This looks like an area that we might find some kind of scrap. That sparkling rock. Shit. There's got to be something with that sparkling rock. Oh. Copper. I have to report my first successful revisit. To uh, AMC, I got my free refill on my Fast X cup. Oh! I felt like a god. Filling up that Fast X cup for free. Oof. 
The investment has already paid off. <gasps> I was hoping for this. Oxygen refills underwater. Oh, good. Sonic. We got Sonic bubbles. I don't think we can combat anything until we get the. Gun. That's the crazy thing, Red Sky. I said there's no limit. That's no one has ever told me an expiration date. So I'm just assuming the end of the year. Is would it be the end of the summer? I mean, usually when you have a cup like that, they it's just forever, like, right? yeah, until you, until you forget <laughs> to bring this it. This might have been the one of the wisest. And I was so happy too because I left mine in the back seat of my car. I said, you know, I'm gonna forget to have this thing, so I'm gonna leave it in my car, so I remember. Is that a mashing. Yo, what is that? That. And I had to go into the thing? restroom and rinse it out again because I just in case any dust got in there. Nothing like being in a movie theater rinsing out your uh, collector's cup in a movie theater restroom, washing out your collector's cup. It's one of my favorite things to do. Sleepy toy hammer. <laughs> there we go. Now we're in the money. Oh, see, we're too low. What? And that's making our oxygen go fast. Can I fight this guy? They don't have strawberries and cream, but Red Sky, as I've stated, what they have, strawberries and cream Mr. Pib, because they have the soda bots where you can customize your own flavors. They have Mr. Pib. You can do strawberries or you can do cherry. It's a dead ringer for the Dr. Pepper thing. So they got the formula locked down. They stole the formula from the Dr. Pepper people. However, I gotta say, I think Dr. Pepper stole the formula from Fanta. I literally think they mixed strawberry Fanta with Dr. Pepper now. I'm pretty sure that's what I've, my palate has dissected the individual ingredients. Parrot Fisher friends. Yeah, big time corporate corporate espionage. But the Fanta people were the first ones that got victimized because they've been running that strawberry Fanta for years and years. Yo, olive oil and soy sauce, bro. Yeah, but Dr Pepper never had the strawberry flavor, RF. Fanta has had it for a long time. <laughs> That's the only reason why I think something may be a little bit uh, dubious Ooh, is going on. Strawberry Crush? Dang it, Touche. Touche to you, Red Sky. I gotta taste that Strawberry Crush. Is that the exact same flavor? I would think it's a little different. Usually Crush does the things a little differently. I want... Orange Crush is good, though. I want sparkling water now. Lots of sodas. We gotta prepare our menu. Uh, lots of strawberry, but I'm talking about this particular strawberry flavor. It's a very particular strawberry flavor. Artificial strawberry flavor. Sunkist has a strawberry flavor now too. Red Sky's claiming. I'm not do two timing on Dr Pepper with strawberry. I look if the if Dr Pepper was available, I'd be with Dr Pepper. But they don't want to go to the movies. Only Pib. Pib is the only one there that shows up. There are different enhancement cutscenes, dude. This is awesome. <laughs> Dr. Pepper had to wash their hair. It kept telling me they had to wash their hair for the sixth time in the day. I said, you're washing your hair all day long. What's happening, Dr. Pepper? Hey, you needed to wash it again? This is incredible. Yeah. This game has been Oh, the look at that. A shockwave and a shockwave. That was sick. A shockwave creating another shockwave. Beautiful. 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 <laughs> Dr. Pepper is who we wed. <laughs> yeah, we're just having some fun with, uh, I'm just having some fun with Mr. Pib, you know? Nothing wrong with a little harmless fun, is there, Uzi? <laughs> Oh, a lot of references in this also, m -Bun? I bet you there might be a Wave Race reference in this. Which one did we just enhance? Oh, this one. P 
Pib Extra. Wait a second, there's some truth to this that you're saying. Uzi Suicide is saying Dr. Pepper sued them and now it's Pib Extra. It is Pib Extra, but why would they sue him? It's not Dr. Pib, it was Mr. Pib. But it was Pib. Mr. Pib. They can't be Mr. Pib? It was What's Mr. Pib that? intentionally to, to ape their vibe. But they were already aping Dr. Pepper singing a crime because. <laughs> oh no, Jesse. I invited Dr. Pepper to the movie. They said it tasted too much like Dr. Pepper. You're saying the taste of Mr. Pib has changed from what it used to be? That I don't know if I believe. Ms. Pib, that's Ms. Pib to you. They call me Mrs. Pib. Oh shit. I gotta upgrade my run, dude. Dr. Pepper deep dive for the next easy update. Would you be willing to do that? Hell yeah. Spend easy update. I don't drink soda, but okay. I'll do whatever you tell me to do. <laughs> On a Dr. Pepper deep dive. <laughs> Dr. Shasta? Was, is it Dr. Shasta? Bloodworth claims there's a Dr. Shasta. Is that real? Shasta's, the Dr. Pepper flavored the Shasta is called Dr. Shasta. <laughs> Speaking of soda, is that not the greatest name for a soda? Shasta? Shasta. Are they still dude. around or did they go kaput? Yeah, I don't know. Shasta. You haven't seen, I haven't seen Shasta in a long time. It's closed! Is Shasta still in business? Chat. Oh, surge Where are we at with Sa Shasta? I used to slug down a lot of Surge back in the day. Sophia says that in Norway, Surge never went away. No way! What about Crystal Pepsi? Did Crystal Pepsi ever go away in Norway? I don't know if she's gone because her internet is broken. Shasta is still going. <laughs> Who the heck is this? Is that a Boston Whaler? Shasta is still around. Dr. Bacon, dude. Major Melon Dew? Is that a Shasta flavor? The Sea People? The sea People Civilization. Here oh we go. Here we go. The sea people. This is cool. This game is bananas. Oh, it's little mermaid mermaids. And they water, wonder, water, waterfalls? How's that possible? I don't know. That's about all there is to serve. <laughs> bacon flavored Dr. Pepper. It's not a bad idea, Jesse. I mean, if you think about it, just eating a plate of bacon with Dr. Pepper sounds super yummy. <sighs> you don't think bacon with drinking Dr. Pepper? Artificial bacon flavoring is gross. Isn't it weird how some artificial flavors are better than the originals and some are worse? Yeah. Bloodworth thinks, thinks there could be underwater waterfalls. If you had yeah. difference in salinity. Yeah. What is the salinity? Salt? Salt. Content? Well, there's that cave that is in, like, Blue Planet or whatever, where, like, if you're under one part of the water, it looks like it's the surface, but it's actually just fresh water above the salt water or whatever. Oh. So that it's less dense, but it, from below it looks like the surface. So oh. people can get fooled by swimming up what through what they think is the surface oh and then breathing. Gosh, what hell. But they breathe water. That's scary. Because it's still That's water. That's so scary. Yeah, it's terrifying. Water, man, is treacherous. You don't fuck with it. Uzi suicide. I have my respect things, for the sea. Suicide talking about taking body shots off of a shoe. A oh, Dr. Pepper body shots of Dr. Pepper. I never heard of such a thing. Off a shoe? Yeah. And Dude, does a shoe have a body? The rain, a shoe is a body. Jesse, the rain is pouring down. What a vibe. That must be cozy. I love when rain is pouring down. Bacon pancakes are good. 70 millimeters. Ketchup flavored Pepsi out yet? Is that true? I heard there was a ketchup flavored Pepsi. It's a deal with certain stadiums. Diving suit upgrades. Cola chop. 
Pepsi flavored ketchup called Cola Chuck. <laughs> that suit could be upgraded over the phone. Oh man, that sounds nice. Some heavy rain. Does that mean you could just spill your Pepsi? You spill your Pepsi on your hot dog and eat it like that? The bun would soak up the Pepsi. Would it be good? If the Pepsi tasted like ketchup? We upgraded our suit, man! Oh, I feel weird! My neck hurts. I gotta get a massage or something. Oh, boil your hot dogs and Pepsi. Yeah, massage would be nice right in there. Right what the hell is this? Grinder or something? Oh, playing Totka while it rains. Too Mini cozy. games. Too cozy, Miguel. Need that scrap iron now. Yeah, what happened to our scrap iron? Yeah, we, got got some... we never found any. <laughs> what are we going to make out of that again? A gun. Yeah, you boil brats and beer. You boil hot dogs and catch in uh, soda and Pepsi. There's soda can chicken. That's a thing, right? Or the beer can. I don't know. A beer can, <laughs> shotgun. We could shotgun a Pepsi. Uh, catch a Pepsi. You wouldn't download a Pepsi. You wouldn't download a catch a flavor Pepsi, would you? I don't know what this does, because I always skip through the description. Maybe I can bop fish on the head if they're going to attack. Oh yeah, hit them with the butt of your knife. Okay, there's our Blade. escape pod. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. These aggressive, what are those, lionfish? They look like a lionfish. Oh! Bludgeon him. It was a lionfish. And I can collect aggressive fish by bopping them. Oh shit, are these barracuda, dude? Barracuda you gotta watch out for, these things are no joke. Yeah, barracuda will F you up. One Yo, time, is that squid, one time dude? I was, uh... Oh, they inked me! Scuba diving in Costa Rica and a, a huge school of barracuda just came out of nowhere and surrounded us and they were going, it was like two silver curtains that were just on both sides of me going by. It was so scary. Do I have to scary. bop them? Chat, do I have to bop scary, these little but... fuckers? Oh, were those squid? Give me the squid, Lord. Chop them up. They're too fast for me. The hell is this? A pink seashell, Charles. Nice. Oh, it oh, broke free. No way, it's too big. I gotta sneak up on them. They get spooked. They're too scared of me. Come on. Get bopped. Get bopped. Oh. Nice. You're not getting away that easy. Can, oh! I don't think I can get him. We need a stronger uh, hook, I, I guess. I need to find this scrap iron. It's got to be on the ground. Oh, you have to. But I need to get fish, or we won't be able to have a fucking. We're not gonna have a little sushi feast. All right, this is good. This is good. Give me that air, baby. We need more sushi. Oh, it fills you up. That nice. is huge. Generous. If you have the little sub thing, does it not take oxygen to boost then? Oh, that'd be nice. How deep does this go? It's just because of how the, the style of these block graphics and stuff, it feel, almost feels like you should be able to rotate around a little bit. Yeah. Like We're at critical depth. Ooh, but an ingredient. So it's us! Oh shit, we're about to get fucked. Die, please! Die, please! Yes! Exceed your weight limit? Oh my fucking god, look at that thing. We gotta get out of here. Sawfish! Right Maybe it's friendly. Limit. What's hanging from its jowls? It has some weird thing hanging. Some kind of 
horrific. Okay. I don't know where the scrap metal is, man. Oh, I saw the recent ads to the Genesis Online. I gotta look at those. That's a sawtooth shark. What was hanging out of its jaw? Does it have a stringy thing hanging from it like that? The Genesis still alive and well. Alive and kicking. In 2023. Feels good. Depressurizing, dude. That's a good detail so we don't get the bends. That does not sound fun. I don't know where the scrap metal is, man. I did get the TurboGrafx 16 Mini. Our restaurant is repaired. It's beautiful! I thought that that would take longer. <laughs> the thing I haven't gotten yet is my is my Astro City Mini, or my, or the second Astro City Mini. Oh, CDJ Gamer got their Lego Pac-Man set in the mail. Mm. Yeah, that's a cat there. Mm. Cooksta? What is it, like a play field of Pac-Man? Or is it a giant? Oh, it's a Pac-Man arcade machine made out of Legos. That's sick. <coughs> oh yeah. Wow, that, that looks new cool. Lego thing. That looks so cool. Nicholas Cage is in Dead by Daylight. That's so funny. Oh, that's so cool. Mm. Nick Cage and DVD today. Mm. Nice, mm. CDJ. You're good. You're gonna be building that. Mm. Nice little project. Mm. Banko Sushi. Cook stuff. Cook stuff. Oh, look at that cute photo of us. Oh. Everyone's happy. We unlock the interior button. They go hocus pocus. A nice Halloween build. Do we like the wood done or do we like this white thing? Uh, I guess we could change it. We have the wood right now or we don't have one? This is what's now. Yeah. This is we could Oriental change it up, modern. I guess, for a clean look. It gives it a nice clean look, doesn't it? Yeah. We have to pay money for these chairs. I can't afford it. Oh wow, look at the Lego Hocus Pocus. That's what? Awesome. There's a Lego Hocus Pocus? Yeah, it's like the house. Do you Is recognize it real? that? Yeah, that's the Sanderson sisters' house. So, oh my god. $230. CDJ <laughs> has that coming in for August. Or I mean Sophia for October. And I have the Oh I want this bonsai! I love bonsais. Sophia and I have the treehouse, but we haven't finished in, it in yet. In Salem you can visit the Hocus Pocus, Pocus house. Have you been there? So cute. I love it. No, I haven't. I, I gotta go like, visit Sam. I bet you like that. I like witches. All right, I added a photo of our little friend group and a oh, bonsai tree. This place is getting cozy. Nice little bonsai. Love Salem, great town. Uzi says I love Salem. They probably have sushi there, fresh sushi, right? Is is it Salem? Yeah, is it near the how ocean? Close, yeah, how close is it? To, I, I thought guess it was I don't pretty know. close. Look at this, a great barracuda. These are the things, the great barracuda. Those are the things that surrounded me in Costa Rica. I've been chased by barracuda before. Salem sushi. Horrifying. We have five barracudas. Dare we enhance this barracuda? Enhancements cutscene. Oh, we've seen this. Oh, it's not that close to the coast, I suppose, actually. Uh, 
I love Dr. Pepper with strawberry. I'll always love it. I'm just saying Fanta Strawberry in many ways was there first. Time skip. Fanta Dragon Fruit? I've never had that. I had the Dragon Fruit LaCroix. Beach Plum. LaCroix just came out with the Beach Plum. It was very nice. I liked it myself. And the can is be absolutely beautiful on the Beach Plum. I don't think I've ever seen such an attractive can before. This is how you take a profile picture? It's hard. Oh, we get followers, and that's how we rank up. I'm a big fan of sarsaparilla. When someone earlier asked if I was, a, if I was into roots, I was going to say I like sarsaparilla. There's a good sarsaparilla joint on the way up to NorCal. You make the drive up there. Sioux City sarsaparilla? Stop, stop and pick yourself up a sarsaparilla soda on the way. Uh, Bravo Town. It's called Bravo Town. They got some nice sarsaparillas there. So wait, I'm confused. It says time skip. I could go diving right now, I think, but... <laughs> it's a nice looking can. The, the can on the plum, the, the plum can, beach plum. Strawberries and cream Dr. Pepper flow. Oh, that does sound good. When you're getting our sweet tooth going. Do you like uh, root beer floats? Sure. Strawberry and cream Dr. Pepper one sounds nice too. Haven't had a root beer float in a while. I haven't either. Did, you, did I try the Dr. Pepper float ice cream? No. Oh, there's an ice cream called Dr. Pepper flavored float. Wow. Chat, um, alas, because we started late, we're going to have to stop here in about a half hour because. I not, have therapy. not everything can be shifted on our schedule. Yeah, yeah my make... therapy did not shift its time, so mm -hmm. we have to stop at four our time to give me enough time to get over there. Yeah, mug is pretty bad. Yeah, mug when it goes flat is a big problem. Mm -hmm. Mug goes flat; it's a major problem. It's got it. Mug is really just riding the carbonation in a lot of ways. Look at that starry sky. Is that picturesque? We time skip. I'm. Perplexed, but we. I hit time skip and we went back out here for some reason. Drink it fresh. Sometimes I like my sodas to breathe a little. Some sodas breathe, you know, like a wine. You let it breathe yeah, a little. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some Get sodas the tannins out. <laughs> some sodas breathe better than others. And a mug Who's root this beer. lady? I found this very Shit. nasty. Shit! She a health inspector, dude? Uh oh, we didn't need this lady here. What's going on? Miss Yoshi. <laughs> She's a so reviewer. Jesse prefers her uh, their mug flat. Jesse prefers their mug flat. <laughs> it aged like a like a fine soda. A and W, yeah, A and W was big, right? That's another one. I don't know if they're still here. Oh, okay. Jesse doesn't like any flat root beer. Yeah, flat, right. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Root beer in general is riding a lot on the carbonation, isn't it? It loses a lot of the magic without the carbonation. Some sodas can. Uh, some sodas don't need the carbonation to still be yummy. Some need. Some use it as a crutch. Root beer uses carbonation as a crutch. White tip reef shark head and olive oil? A and W, no one knows what A and W ever stands for. No one's figured that out, have they? Stewart's root beer is top tier, but I don't know if you can get you can't get that anywhere. I've never even heard of Stewart's root beer. Where do you get this stuff? I would be surprised if you could get this anywhere outside of uh, 
your locale, sort of local region there. Mm. Jersey! That's the East Coast root beer? Well, that explains a lot. We haven't even, we've never seen it. We've never heard of it over here. The root beer wars. The East Coast, West Coast root beer wars. Special customers root beer with is a hor backstory. Now, look at this. Osiris is coming in here to say root beer is horrible all across the boards. Carbonation or no carbonation. And what about a root beer float? You don't like that either, Os Osiris? Would you even take a bite or a little sip of a root beer float? Ooh, we can research new recipes. Ooh. New sushi recipes or actual yeah. food? Oh, wow. Whole roasted shark. I have to use my artisan's flames uh, for your bullshit recipe? Shark head? It needs olive oil. We have olive oil. I gotta go find a reef shark. I was thinking about it. I love these cutscenes. Holy crap. Oh, he's researching it, I guess. A lot of over here. 60. Look at that. People love it. Wow, okay. Shark head people go for But I gotta shark. kill a shark with a gun. Do they scoop the eye out and eat it? I wonder. Ugh. We ordered duck, like authentic ch Chinese duck the other day, and they had that. They left the head in there. Did you, bite, did you eat the neck? No. You didn't eat the neck? I always wonder about that when they serve the duck with the neck. My my or not you're supposed to eat the neck. My delicate culinary American sensibilities would not allow me to even gaze upon oh. the duck's head. So Osiris. But my is... friends were like, yeah, oh yeah, they always give me the head. It's great. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> the, the duck head? You eat the bill? Durner. Ice cream would make it a bit better, but still a no. So Osiris still doesn't want to try the root beer float. European though, so not really a thing over here. That's fine. I'm not nuts about root beer. What about a sarsaparilla? You ever had a sarsaparilla you liked? A sarsaparilla? Who, me? No, I'm asking Osiris, because they don't like... Osiris does not like root beer, which I respect. Sarsaparilla is just like fancy root beer, or what's the deal? It's not even really a root beer, so I don't know why I consider it insane. But some reason, I could, I could put it in the same classification. It's like an old soda. In the Old West, the only sodas they had were root beer and sarsaparilla, I think. I now understand that I have to individually add things to the menu, even if we have more than one. Oh, weird. What, a col what about cola champagne? Time like I'm not gonna be champagne? able to get her that shark head. We don't have a shark. She wants that shark head, we gotta go catch a shark. Yeah, classic it's cherry. funny in um, video games how walking seems insane and slow, but in real life you don't run around everywhere. Like working in a restaurant, you don't sprint to a customer, you know? Yeah. Oh yeah, there should be a uh, auto restock option <laughs> if you have multiple of a thing. It is a little bit, I would say it's more like a cream soda. Yeah, sarsaparilla is more like cream soda, isn't it? Wendy's Cherry Cream Soda. Whoa. Oh, so noodles worked for Geek Squad. Are the vans like. as nice as they look? Because it looks like a nice vehicle inside. Are they as nice on the outs inside as they are on the outside, those uh, Geek Squad vehicles? Yo, she's loving it! Nice. They love it. Ooh, look at all that cash. Big tip. Squirt. I still drink squirt to this day. Squirt is great. Oh, I want some squirt. Yeah. Now. I wonder if you could put like vodka in squirt. You know you can. I've had that years back. Really? I had vodka and squirt. It was okay. It was okay. I seem to remember. Maybe I got some heartburn from it or something though. Why do my eyes hurt so bad? Jesse says you can. You can dump vodka into it. You can put vodka in just about anything. Yeah, that's true, right? I mean, vodka is the most versatile alcohol on earth. I haven't yeah. drank it in years. That's because it's such a mild flavor. I guess so. Gay water, as uh, my friend calls it. Vodka soda. That's good. It's, it's gay water. That's good. My eyes are, they're more like strained than dry. Vodka's neutral. Yo, dude, we're getting, we're blowing up on Cooksta, dude. Hell yeah, thanks, Rose Pink. Wind Fox is going to go to a horror convention this weekend and getting a picture of the director from The Crow. The first Crow. Wait, what? Alex Proyas is doing something? What happened? The Crow? 
Wind Fox. Oh, you got a picture on. with the crow? With the they're going, Alex they're Price? About, they're planning it. That's sick. They're premeditating this picture with the director. Ellie hates us, dude. Why? Are they the one that bought the shark head? No, they're the student. They think we're weird. Squirt while in Mexico, so they have a different kind of squirt formula down there, like their Coke. I always, you always hear about the Mexican Coke, Mexican Coke. So they got a Mexican squirt too, huh? Next time I'm in. Well, I imagine it's similar <laughs> properties because it's just real cane sugar, right? Is that yeah, the probably. It's made with real sugar, not corn syrup. And yeah. yeah, I guess some places in Mexico, depending where you go, you get your actually get the so you order a soda, they give it to you in a plastic bag. You ever had that? They give you in a I mean, plastic bag with a straw. Comes from a plastic bag out of a fountain. Not everybody knows this. If you get a dolphin. Oh no! Don't do it. I'm not gonna hurt the dolphin. I refuse. What if the what if uh? Although what apparently dolphins hunt for sport. Dolphins have a lot in common. With the you. dolphin has a request. It's almost scary. Look at me! I'm swimming with the dolphin. New best friend. New best friend. It's gonna go too deep. It, yeah, haven't they found that some dolphins are like serial killers? Also, they do all kinds of weird stuff that uh, that's oxygen that right? only people do. You know, like yeah, other they, like, like animals no, kill, but they don't—they're not serial they hunt, killers. They hunt turtles for sport. Yeah, and apparently though, some of them that are like deranged, they actually are like. Dolphin, wait for me! I found some scrap iron. I need that. Forty-two dollars for a twelve-pack of squirt from Mexico. Some of that it has to be sh shipping in hand. <laughs> Ted Bundy, the dolphin. Did we lose him, dude? They do both, that's true, Pixelate. Oh shit! How do I cut the net? Okay. Oh! I love this, I love helping the dolphin. What do you think? Do you think this dark dolphin has dark intentions? No. I hope this not. This dolphin is our friend and that's its baby. Thank you, dolphins. Oh, they left us a pink thing! What was that? A gem? I don't know. Is Dolphin that a gem. is that a dragon crystal? Oh, it's its mate. A pearl, dude! It's gotta be oh, worth something. Oh, pink dolphins would be so cool. I wish. What's all this wood right? for? I wonder. All right, we gotta get some fish. Boncho's gonna kill us. <laughs> dolphin shit. Love above said maybe that pink ball was dolphin shit. I actually funny. thought that, that it... What? Come on. <laughs> He's so funny. Ah, oh, you bastards! These fish are too too cool for school, You get man. pink dolphin? Is this a joke? There's some pink dolphins in Brazil? Alright. I can't click on this, but if this is true, this I'm going to be news. a lot happier. The rest of my, my day is going to be way happier. Amazon River Dolphin. I gotta see how pink these things are. Are they neon pink? Ah, fuck off, you weirdos! I'm gonna turn you into sushi, pink guys! Dolphin. Oh, look at that! There are pink dolphins! Oh, that one's really pink! What the hell? These big fish, do I gotta bop them, chat? What's the deal? <laughs> Some of these dolphins are neon pink. What a world we live in, Isla, like, continues to be beautiful. The world continues to be beautiful. Amazon Riven Dolphins, I think they're pretty. I got it. Some of them are very oh. bright pink. Is that a real picture? Look how pink that thing is. An ultra rare pink dolphin. So this isn't even the Amazon one. This is just a, a regular dolphin that turned pink. I wonder if they have a certain diet, if they eat certain coral, or not coral, but... Like oh, yeah, like a flamingo or whatever. Or, yeah. Look at these, some of these dolphins are bright, 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 bright pink. There's that shark I need, but I do not have a gun, so... That is awesome. I want to turn off the mashing. I don't really love to mash. Right in the face! Oh, get bopped. Get bopped, fish. Oh, ever play Jaws on the ne Me, uh, My neighbor and I used to play Jaws on the NES oh, so much. 
catching those conch shells. Oh, that game was sick as hell. To me, back when I was a little kid and I played Jaws on the NES, it felt like an open world game because you could just sail all around the overworld map, dive oh. wherever you wanted. That's pretty cool. A lot of conch shells. Mm -hmm. You ever had a conch fritter? Those are yummy. Miguel remembers Jaws on the NES also. Oh, we used to play that a lot. Duff's weapon shop onto your foot. And then you had to go to the front screen, right? The first person view where you'd spear Jaws with the ship, right? Well, that's Duff. What? Look at this guy. This, like, anime nerd gun guy? <laughs> Yeah, the random <laughs> encounters were brutal. That was good, God. Yeah. The man touched God. Here we go. Basic underwater rifle. These fish are in trouble now. Yeah. Okay. Weapon chests. Ooh. He just says you could say after everything. Seb two thirty one SCB two thirty one thinks they live in murky water, so maybe that's why they're turning pink, so they can be seen easier. <laughs> A Gatling Triple gun. Triple barrel. What is that? Triple axle. Wow. A certain number of times. Well, oh, there goes oh, my shoe. I caught it with my shoe. <laughs> Avatar game would be cooler if it had underwater levels. Yes, one of the most disappointing things was, uh, about that Avatar presentation. Look at this guy! Oh, it's the Batman duck boat. <laughs> Batman Returns duck boat. Yeah, when they clearly made it, you know, apparent that there weren't going to be underwater mm. sections. That was a big disappointment. I think a lot of there was a lot of expectation Marinka? for that, probably. <laughs> Ocean Life trading cards. Hey, I read the fish in real life. The, the, the pace at which they're metering out new stuff <laughs> is very good. You get a card for everything you've caught. The graphical style in this is so interesting because it's like 3D but pixel art. Yeah. Gotta fish them all. Yeah, that is uh, literally an old ash, isn't it? From. Oh uh, uh, yeah, I think. Yeah, it, I was like, it, I guess Pokemon is has, the thing they're yeah, not gonna it, say. Yeah, it's pretty funny. That is funny. It's like some mean five o'clock shadow. Blue hole medium, medium depth. Oh, Sato is short for Satoshi. What's Satoshi? Isn't that Ash? Is that his real Ash name? Ash Ketchum. Does he have a name other than I Ash? Yeah, it's Satoshi. All right, time to fight That's a, a shark. That's a big time nod. That's a Japanese name. Oh, okay. The sushi decks. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're gonna fight a shark, chat. I don't know how to shoot my gun, but we're gonna do it. Okay, I RB to switch to the gun.
pyramid butterfly fish. Okay, I'm not gonna waste bullets on that little little guy. Do these count toward my weight? Oh yes, they do. Oh no, we don't. The copper air ore. Whoa, machete. A katana. A cheap katana. But I don't have it. Don't we wish that they would just die? Oh no, we don't. Ammo box. Oh, okay. Well, if I have an ammo box right here, let's fuck this guy up. Oh, wait, I do have the sword. Slice Got and dice. Him. That worked good. Alright, there's our emergency room. Oxygen capsule, dude. Gosh, this game is marvelous. Oh, just out of our range. Just a bit outside. Uh, that, why would that fish swim right back after they got away? Came back again for third. Yeah, that fish. Gotta stop loading up on wood. Crazy. Gotta load up on fish or Bacho's never gonna let me come back in the house. The sword is amazing. Oh fuck, I'm already overweight? Where's this shark? There it is. Here we go. Shark head soup coming up. How did that, how did that not, how am I not fighting him? No, oh, there we go. Okay, I died. Shark got me immediately. Shit, dude. Peace out, Uzi. Yeah, he uh, did a lot of damage. <laughs> well, Boncho is uh, not pissed at me too bad, so. Night, Uzi. Nighty night, Uzi. Alright, so we'll do this. This night in the shop, and then maybe we'll call it. Upgrade our little restaurant. What do we get? Ornate Rossa. I like these fish drawings. This yeah. game is so cute, dude. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is so good. <laughs> it's beautiful. That looks yummy. Is they like it. Can we upgrade our rank yet? Not yet. Alright, here we go. There's just like another shoreline becoming visible when the tide goes down every once in a while. Oh, wow, that's, that's cool. cool. Watch, where is it? Lady, we don't have your shark head. I'm sorry. Still wants a shark head. We tried. <laughs> Haven't had enough of another but perfect since I we opened this restaurant. Yeah. Specky. What up? 
It melts in the mouth! Do you like sushi, Don? Love sushi. Yeah, that's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, she just keeps coming back and asking for that shark head. Here we go, some authentic wasabi. Hell yeah. Only the best at Bancho yep. Sushi, dude. Hello? I want to give you your uh, green tea. Perfect pour, dude! Nice! Bro! Nailed that. Nailed that pouring. New repices. Ooh, kitchen staff, menu slot, wasabi amount. Why'd you guys sit way down here, man? <laughs> that'd be, that'd be, like, why'd you have to sit way down here, man? <laughs> why'd you have to sit way down here, man? Don't leave, don't leave, don't leave, don't leave, don't oh, leave, no. don't leave, don't leave, don't leave! Oh, shoot! Oh, fuck! That bastard way at the end! No! Go, 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 go! Oh, oh you stamina! Dang it! No. Oh, we had your food Piss, right there, dude, man. that's your own fault for sitting way the fuck down at the fucking end of the fucking bar, man! Oh. What the fuck? I'm not quick! I'm uh, not strong! You were right there. I, I, was right I actually there. walked into a fat, it was like a Taco Bell the other day into the lobby, and, and, there was, and as I walked in, there was a guy there, he's like, mad obviously and the the guy was coming up to help him and he's like what there's no one here or what like no one's working he's like and the guy's like yeah i'm here i'm here what do you need and he's like yeah forget about it man and he like walks out and i was like why would you leave yeah definitely gonna take longer to go to a different <laughs> yeah. establishment guy um okay i guess that took less time than i thought we'll dive one time look can i upgrade my suit or anything the last dive Ah, bronze! Yay! We received an award. Please uh, come visit. I love Boncho, dude. You gonna get on that Blue Sky app that everyone's gassing on about? Yeah, I'm gonna get on. Really? I think we so. We need invites. We gotta get on it. I gotta get on it. Threads are getting released tomorrow? What's that oh. mean? We're in. Tomorrow's the day. This guy's pretty he's pretty sketch. RF is sick. Blue Sky is sketch? I didn't know that. Damn it. I figured everything is sketch, you know? Shock harpoon tip, dude? That seems good. I need to upgrade my weight limit. Yes, got that sword. Love it. Threads is Instagram's Twitter clone? Are they putting that on Instagram? Ooh, I don't love that shit. Oh, look at that school, dude. Oh, we gotta get in there. We gotta fish this school. Mastodon still going? What the heck's going on? Mastodon. I, was I, don't know, I never bothered. I thought it was dead in the water. quality better if you kill it with the sword versus the harpoon? I don't think so, but that's an interesting question, actually. Does it have better quality or better ranking? Depending how you kill it. The less you mince it up. Dunno. Alright, we're carrying too much. 
We're encumbered. Oh yes, apparently uh, Seat Lanes is saying uh, the fish quality is higher if you catch it with a harpoon. Oh, okay. Nice kill. Little O2. We've really got to up our weight class here. Artful is great alternative if you're an artist. Hmm. Artful is a good... Is for... Is like Twitter? Everybody's got a Twitter these days. Everybody's got a Twitter. Fuck off, please. Where's my health? Or does it just tank my air? That's a good question. I like Instagram. Oh, silver bowl, dude, that's gotta be... Is that a... Is that a fish people? Oh no, we're not at that depth. Cause that lady's shark head. Fuck, that shark is gonna kill our ass. That uh -oh, freaky he sees us now. fish. Oh! Get me out of here, get me out of here! Oh, we're leaving! Oh no! Yeah, it's tanking our air, bro. It's going oh, on us! It bit through our oxygen tube. Silver bowl? Shit! We're chum. We chummed the waters. Yeah, with ourselves. With ourselves. <laughs> I guess that was not a sea people artifact. It was too high in the water. That shark was very aggressive. Yeah. <laughs> now that's a crunch. <laughs> yeah, that's literal crunch. We got crunched. Threads getting released in a few minutes. Actually, not weirder is telling us. Oh, is that just an additional thing on Instagram? Cause I like Instagram. Thank you everybody for watching. Sorry it was shorter today. We had to shoot something that I think you'll like. It'll be up on Saturday. Uh, yeah, follow me on Instagram, everybody. I'm just I Hink on Instagram. Don, what the hell are you doing? You still That's connected. That's important business to conduct. Um, I'm on Mixer, yeah. Get me on there, too. I mean, they're all evil. Everyone's evil. Meta is... It is Threads is separate from... Is it, what? Zuckerberg is more evil. He's going for it? It's a separate app? It's oh, more Lord. evil. It's more evil. What is? Threads. Facebook is maybe less evil than Elon Musk. <gasps> Elon Musk is evil. I don't know. Elon Musk is evil. Is it evil if you don't hide your evilness compared to if you pretend you're not evil, though? Continuously? <laughs> even though I mean, yeah. Are. At least he has no They're shame They're all about evil. It. But he's just a fucking piece of shit. On the outside, though. Threads. Listen, I'll sign up for it. See what happens. And then if it when, it, when it crashes up. and burns, I'll just not use we're it. We're all evil. Like Specky's, hive. Specky's claiming we're all evil. Elon dethroning the Zupperbot. All billionaires are evil. Threads should launch at four. The launch got pushed forward. Not weird. Who's telling us now? It's launching at four. That's in. Four minutes, five, six if minutes. If Elon and Mark create their own spheres, we'll forgive them. And we will join their social media apps then. But first they have to make spheres. What they should really do is eradicate poverty. Well, what about the spheres? We when we need something to look at. They could we? build, that could be part of the plan to eradicate uh, poverty is to build spheres to, to house more people. <laughs> spheres are not a good use of space, by the way. Just putting that out there. 
the parking lots around Sphere. You're missing out on all those corners. You could be filling with yeah. people. <laughs> Threads isn't coming to the EU. It didn't uh. pass the protection of personal data. <laughs> What's up with Europe protecting their people? <laughs> They're gonna. Europe just seems like they're really data, doing a good job protecting. First the Skittles yeah. things, now this. I wish our government looked out for us like Europe does. I wish our government did a lot of things. All billionaires can buy should eradicate poverty, homelessness, and malnutrition. Increase poverty, capitalism for you. That's true. Good on Europe. Yeah, shout out to Europe. Shout out to Europe for actually regulating things. Yeah. Right? Shout out to New Zealand for regulating guns. In New Zealand. Do they sell Skittles in New Zealand? Probably not, dude. But they don't. Probably not. And if they do, they probably have a different kind of paint on them. Skittle paint. Hunter Schaefer's walking around in the desert, I Speaking guess. Speaking of guns, you know what they're selling now? They're selling instead of, you know the little poppers that you pull the little string and they do a pop? Yeah. They shoot the confetti out? Now they're selling, them. they shoot as a gun and you pull a trigger. I don't like that. Giving these to two-year-olds. I don't love that. They told me they're telling me to give my two-year-old a gun, and <laughs> pull the trigger. I don't like that. I said pull the trigger. I don't like that, Don. I don't like it one oh, bit. Oh, shout out to Canada National Healthcare, the dream. You look at my foot; it's getting better. You with or without healthcare? Can you believe that? The human body. I mean, right? Looking at him, I can't tell which one was the one that got hurt. <laughs> it's good. It's healing. Yeah. Nature is healing, everyone. Nature finds a way. Feet find a way. Pull the string. Okay. Pull the strings. Hi, everyone. Pull the strings. Thank you, Red Sky. It feels so good to be getting better. Thank you, Magical Bark. Foot's healing. Peace out, everyone. Wait, keep screaming, pull the strings. Pull the strings! Pull the strings! How's that? <laughs> pull the strings! Yes! Pull the strings! 